look. Beautiful display, really. At this we are warning. Those who defy Shah's will shall suffer darkness without her blessing. Well. You hear that, Shadowheart? If you defy Shah's will, you will find yourself in darkness without a blessing. Perhaps keep that in mind. Next time you want to sass me about killing a cleric of Saluna. I mean the cheek. The absolute cheek. Okay, let's go into the basement here and see what we can find. Oh, look! A keyhole. Well, where there's a keyhole, we can pick the lock. Marvellous. Here we go. Into the depths. Note from the basin. Congratulations on finding this place, thief, but your journey ends here. What, did you cask of Montelato someone? Can't see. Okay, well that seems like a trap. <laughs> I'm failing all of my perception rolls, basically, but I still realize it's a trap. Okay, well, let's venture in here. Oh, well, uh, I can see the enemy. Hmm. Estarian, can you just, uh... Just throw a little fireball out this direction. That'd be marvellous, darling. Let's actually... Let's all of us just go like this. Actually, I think the best place to go is right here in the, in the light. Now you, darling. Okay, that's not going to do near enough damage for my taste. Oh? There we go. Oh my god, it only did seven damage to them. And they healed immediately. <laughs> I hate that so much. Okay, uh, okay, fine. Just, uh, shoot ice at that shadow. Okay, well, you, darling, you go Slayer mode. Beast mode. <laughs> Actually, Minthara, you're going to stand up now. And you, Shadowheart, just fall back for a moment. You can actually sneak around, because you don't need to be in the Moon Lantern. So I want you to go over here and hit this fellow with a guiding bolt. And he's dead. Marvellous. Well, thank you for the reminder, Kachai. I am drinking right this way. Mm. Alright, whose turn is it? Astarian, uh, get away from that. Oh, it's me. Never mind. <laughs> I have to say, get away from that horrible monster. But that horrible monster was me. So, it's fine. Now from here, can you actually hit that? Oh no, it's not your turn. Never mind. Well, you can do a bonus action, so give that a little stabby boy. Over there. Come on. Come fight me. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on. I'm looking forward to it. I want to see what the Slayer form can do. Right, Minthara, you, my dear, fall back slightly, and then 
There's actually not no enemies visible at the moment. So I'm going to say that none of this is actually helpful at all. Oh no! Give Soul Brand on the Dark Slayer. No, you can't. Apparently, that's interesting. Uh, I'm not actually sure what to do here. Hold person? That's not a person. I don't think you can do much in, except actually just killing the thing, which I don't want you to do. I want to use my Slayer for. Simintharis not going to take a turn at all. Now you, let what do you, what can you? Sumptuous bloodbath. Slash opens a foe's. Vital arteries. Well, they don't have vital arteries. Multi-attack. Probably one of the better options. Let the slaughter begin. Brand nearby creatures with a sinister mark so that their deaths make you harder to kill. Interesting. And that that's interesting as well. But for now, we're just going to do the multi-attack. Well, that was actually very underwhelming. Uh, okay, just do this then. Bowl's Murderous Mark, sure. Okay, I don't know where the shadow is there. Now, a starting. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't actually do much damage last time, so... Good luck. That didn't do much damage either. Oh, you got her. You got her. Uh, Shadowheart, I think it's time for you to just employ your favorite spell. Instantly dead. <laughs> Instantly dead. <laughs> the Spirit Guardian is just so overpowered. Also, you can jump rather high. I did not know that. Spiritual weapons are not doing much good, but it is keeping that thing off of me. Now, I think the best bet is just Minthara doing a smite at this point. In fact, a double smite. Let's get rid of the ring. Marvelous. And Ball's Boon then grants my Dark Urge, I guess, another 10 health? Or no clue, honestly. Okay. And then Minthara, you can actually just wait. Your turn's over. Now you lot. If you want to fight me, you have to get close. Marvelous. It saved. I couldn't slay it quick enough. Okay. Alright. No, you can't even move that quick. Well, that's fine. A starting. Oh, Astarian's, Astarian has Bull's Murderous Mark as well. Interesting. So it affects the player characters as well. I think that might be, I mean, not useful, but at least it means that, you know, if they die, you do get a little benefit from it. So I think the best way for me to actually kill things is just to keep running around in, in a... <laughs> With the Spirit Guardian. It's the most effective method of killing things. Oh? Don't you dare, Necrotic Claw, my Astarian. I don't care if he's getting sassy. Excellent. Okay, dismiss your Slayer form. Slay no longer. Lovely. Well. <laughs> and we've all leveled up, except for Astarian. Who just sucks too much, apparently. Let's start with Shadowheart. Let's see where we can bring her. I'm thinking actually we might end up respecking Shadowheart completely, so this turn isn't going to matter too much. I th we're going to keep her a cleric because that's quite vital to her character. But the trickster domain just is rubbish. It's it's hot garbage. <laughs> so we're going to respec her. So none of this really matters too much. Uh, we could also. Oh, she is. We could make her a heavy armor master too, but I love this on her. Polearm master is probably going to be... Yes. Okay. 
We're going to take that, and we're going to we're going to mess with her a little bit later. I mean, we're going to change that around. But... Okay, I can choose a specialization if I go bard. Which I mean, that seems worthwhile. Use your wit to distract a creature and sap its confidence. Combat inspiration, not exciting. And College of Swords. Slashing Flourish. Attack up to two enemies at once. Prowess with words and weapons to fight and entertain in equal measure. I don't know if I want to be doing these. Well, these are Flourishes, so they are... They're a bonus action, yes? No, they're action. Well, that's intriguing. If they were bonus action, that would be good. Uh, two weapon fighting. When you make an attack with your offhand weapon, you add your ability modifier. But that's charisma in this instance, isn't it? I think I might choose to go with uh, more... I don't know. Do I care that much about this right now? I don't. So let's go with more, more uh, rogue right now. Pick another skill or two. Intimidation. No. We need performance. I suppose I can't actually do anything else, can I? No. Okay. Well, I guess that's just it. <coughs> <coughs> and Minthara. What are we going to do with you, darling? I think I need you to be alert because she's she's lagging behind everyone else. So we're going to give her alert for now. We'll see about changing that later, perhaps. But now she absolutely needs it. Uh, and I think we'll probably keep the spells mostly the same. Alright, well let's investigate this area. Letter. Alfred, you're probably surprised that I'm writing. They're no more surprised than me. You warned me of Thornton's malice. Yet I took up hammer and trowel to build that cursed tower. You warned me of the coming war, yet I built the prison that would contain his foes. You warned me. I did not listen. It is my deepest regret, and I must atone. I know more about the tower's construction than anyone, and possess innumerable tools and supplies, supri supplies besides. Gather your allies at last light, and let us devise a plan to infiltrate Moonrise. Catholic plans for warm. War, not war. <laughs> he expects to face halberds and staves in light of day. We will end him with a dagger to the back before he can so much as raise a blade. I don't expect you to forgive, but I hope that you'll try. Your brother, Morfred. And the Mason's Log here. The Thorns are Selenite through and through, or so I believe. Perhaps Kethric only converted for Melodia, and with her death and then his daughters, his faith died too. But to turn to Shah, it beggars belief. Catholic's Justicars, or Justicias, anyway, are growing greater in number and more determined to route out any, root out, any, hmm, not sure about that, if that's a mistake, but anyhow, any traces of Saluna within Wraithwyn. Why do they think this town was built? One cannot rip out the foundations of a building and expect it to remain standing. Brother and I remain the last two bastions of our silver lady in the town. A few, the trusting few, come to worship in secret by moonlit nights. Others, convicts all. Whether they truly believe, I cannot say. Impossible, isn't it? Sick of standing idle while justiciers gain power in our humble town. What will become of us if we allow this it? I met a man who was no man, touched by a devil, or maybe worse. But he offered me something I couldn't refuse. Help. The time is now. Catherick's justiciers. Their stronghold in the temple below. They will be wiped out. All of them. I didn't ask how. I just want them gone. Let the Harpers have it, Catherick, now. They'll make short work at him. Okay, well, there we go. Astarion got his level up. We investigated the Salunite uh, resistance. And as a result, Astarion has leveled up. Now it was starting. What will you unlock for us? Ice Storm is quite useful, actually. You know, we might take that. It has a wonderful AoE. 
And then... I don't know the point of that, really. Lightning bolt. Oh yes, let's take that. That sounds like fun. Uh, and then we will get rid of... I'm not really using Thunder Wave. Or Blight. I know they are more useful spells for me, probably, uh, as a Necromancer, but... <sighs> I can't go in for them. Warcaster, you gain advantage on saving throws to maintain concentration on a spell. That's probably worthwhile. The last thing you want is a, is a spell just <laughs> having the concentration broken when you're ready to go. Okay, now, I believe that is also trapped up there, is it? I've played this game too much, to the point where I know where all the... <laughs> I know when the chests are trapped before I do my perception fails. Uh, okay, well, this is just going to hurt a little bit, I think. Unfortunately, I can't uh, undo the trap, so... Yes, I'm sore. That's fine. I took... Actually, it seems I, I avoided the hit entirely. Is there a button here? Can I see it? I'm, I'm failing all my perception checks again. There we are. A moonrise diagram. There's... Well, there we go. Worth a look indeed. Let's take all these goodies. Well, hello, my darlings. I have returned as promised. I do hope you're all doing just marvelously and haven't missed me too terribly. <laughs> now, I'm here, and we can get back to causing all sorts of hell. Hello, uh, Brawler Viz. Oh yes, the dryad is up top, isn't he? Am I sufficiently sated? Well, not quite. All I got myself was some water. <laughs> but it's very important to stay hydrated. Why are we walking around this way? Let's go, let's just walk up here. This seems <laughs> unnecessary. I mean, someone might give us trouble about Minthara, but I mean, who is really going to give us trouble about Minthara? Who really wants to tangle with me? I'll stab them. You seek arms. I seek a warrior worthy to bear. All right. Well, I'm not going to threaten him right away, as much as I would like to. Uh, we can sell the mighty cloth. I don't. I don't really see that as being super beneficial. No snacks, no, darling. I, really, I don't like to. I don't like to eat snacks when I'm streaming. Makes too much noise. Okay, so we can sell some of these things that we actually just got back when we killed uh, the quartermaster. I don't think I'm ever going to use that. And then what else can I sell? Well, I might end up using that at some point. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, we can sell the cellulite uh, garbage, though. And that mirror, these chalices, you know, all of this is quite silly. It's quite superfluous. We don't need it. I don't... I'm going to keep that trade visa, though. <laughs> that seems like it might be valuable. Alright. Alright, let's go around. I want to actually go into the basement too. For a little bit. Hello, Acolyte Kimberl. Who's this fellow? Don't mind me and her mute sounds. It's just her brain flopping around in her skull. Charming. Uh, hello, Betty. Stink of dead gods and dust. Mm. You 
This room is scarcely worthy of our absolute. This hood had tiny ear holes. Well, you need the tiny ear holes when you have long ears. Hello, Mig. Oh, this is the meat sounds we were talking about. That's your brain sloshing around in your head. Is it you? No. Make only small. This huge. The walls above. Maybe all tower. Okay, Mick. You know, I, I will go looking for the meat for you. I'm a very generous man. <laughs> okay, so there should be... There's a hidden treasure in this cracked wall, isn't there? Yes. Let's break the wall by shooting it with a tiny little crossbow. That That's definitely going to work. Oh, lovely. A little bit of gold. We just have to explore around here. We don't we don't spend enough time around Moonrise. <gasps> Hello, Steel Claw. Can we have a little chat? Who are you? A Mind Flayer tadpole. This cat has killed a Mind Flayer tadpole. Yours is a face I shred in my dreams. One who kicked the Steel Claw as if I were some stray. I am a champion hunter. When I lick my Oh, that's me. For you, the slithering vermin I hunt is my attention. For now. What do you mean? I've kicked you. Uh, try to remember what was forgotten. Sure. You excavate the empty caverns of your useless mind, shoveling, dozing, blasting through the smooth brain. How the kitty cat mewed when your boots stamped upon its tail. You are the black cat crossing the path of the living. Oh. The pleasure of the memory dribbles out. <laughs> oh dear, we've killed another animal. Uh. Let's just start laughing, sure. Uh, no, let's be hard. Okay, that's what's what's more unhinged in this case. I think laughing is probably better. I think meowing is just too unhinged. Okay, well, we've killed a cat. Again. We only kicked it last time. Meow. Uh, cat hole. There's a cat hole here. Well, for now, but do we have do we have reduce? We have enlarge. Oh, this works for reducing as well. But I think even then, I would probably be too big. But I do have no. That's scratch. Uh, Astarian, can you summon a cat? There we go. Perfect. Now, cat, go through the cat hole. No. Can you meow? Very useful. Thank you, cat. Hello? Sir? Do you have a problem with my cat? You... You brought her the moon witch? Yes. She is clean. I killed her. Do you see it in her eyes? <laughs> no, I don't. Uh, so, wait, is... Are they happy with me now? Because I killed Isabel, and uh, Marcus just took her body, and I guess Kethrick has revived it or whatever. Okay, I don't think I can get in there, unfortunately. Which is a terrible pity, but oh well. By my oath. Let's get on with it. Certainly not worth having a druid around. I mean, we, we've killed all of the possible druids that we could have had on our team already. Now, I think it might be wise for us to go and visit... Uh, oh, right, we had her killed, too. Uh, is there anything on her body? No. Okay. 
Well, she's dead. Everyone here seems dead. Uh, you, lady. Araj. I don't think you have anything useful for me either. So. Ooh, spicy pork sausages. There's nobody questioning that. That doesn't seem right. Alright, we're going down into the prison again. I found the meat midge. Uh, it seems to be falling out of that one doorway for some reason. Very meaty. Okay. Well, let's go down here and start harassing some of the prisoners, because it's fun. Do a little quick save, because I actually don't remember the last time I did. Hello, prisoners! Let's just grab a stick and start beating on the... Oh, right, there's, there's no... There's no, uh... <laughs> there's no tieflings here. But there is Walbrin Bongle. Hello, Walbrin. Conversation's been cut short. These prisoners are the disciple Balthazar's attention only. It's all right. I have a permit. Oh, two seventeens. <laughs> You should be afraid. I mean, look at me. Don't worry, not to worry, I have a perfect... I just wanted to torment you in peace. Yeah, come on, I want to torture you. I could help you get out of here for a prize. Undercover. No, I'm going to just use my rope. I never liked prisons much. Oh, yes. Me neither. Nasty little boxes. We're going to help Bongle here just because uh, A, we've already killed Barkus. And, and B How did you end up in here? Uh Walbrin uh he's a very interesting man. All that matters is no. how we're gonna get out. Gnome. Okay, oh, well, I'll have a little look because I'm probably going to kill the warden for fun. Alright, well, last time we tried this on stream, uh, we let them out <laughs> by accident. We pulled the lever and they all ran to their death to the guards. This time, we're not doing that. I mean, this time, we might not even help them. I haven't decided yet. Hello, warden. Do you? Keep your bloody thoughts to yourself and your head down. You're going to tell me everything you know. Oh dear. Does someone think they're important? You are small, true soul, insignificant. See, it's very easy for me to just go around stabbing people because they really just ask for it. Like, the, the warden, no matter how nice you try to be to her, is begging for death throughout the, the conversation. She has such a terrible attitude. Even if you're not dead. Respect. 
proven yourself unworthy of. And now, you waste my time. Regardless, know this. I am the warden. The prisoners are my charges, and I answer to Disciple Balthazar himself. Stay on my good side. Mm. No wonder I didn't... Really. You know what, actually? We're just going to attack her, because the attitude is intolerable. This is why I'm playing Dark Urge, because so many of the NPCs have attitude and they need to be taught a lesson. Okay, let's uh, do a psionic backlash and a counter spell. The cat's too- I forgot the cat was with us. Okay, now a Starian, darling. First and foremost, run up on her. Give her a little nibble. She'll love it. Wonderful. Now, Vampiric Touch. Minthara, your turn. The Warden begs for the sweet release of death, and you will grant it to her. What next? Try harder, darling. There we are, and Shadow Heart. Mm, that would be cutting it close. Oh, you know, it's about 50-50. Let's hit her with a, a radiant bolt instead, though, if we can. There we are. Now she's dead. And that's what you get for mouthing off. Okay. Cat, you just stand there and meow. Run inside. And close the door. Can you close the door? A, a door? a cat cannot close the door. <laughs> oh, Trixie. Mm, yes, that's definitely going to be a real serious threat. This is actually a bit of a problem for us. We can't see anything so long as the spell continues. Uh, you know what? Uh, I can't even cast that because I'm completely blinded. No, I, I literally can't even escape the room. But what if I go outside? And that's what you get. Oh, I accidentally hit my own people. <laughs> oh dear, the, do the dirge is very close to death. Okay, you spawn this right here. Now, put that there. Minthara, uh, you probably shouldn't have hit uh, our people quite as hard as that. Okay. Now, this should be... Oh, they're not disadvantaged. I'm, I'm intrigued. Okay, that's the spiritual weapon. Magic missile. And she'll probably be dead next turn. Or not. Interesting. Yes, creep, keep screaming. That's very much going to do the job, I'm sure. Oh, we do actually have another another uh, competitor here. Another fellow who thinks he can uh, face us. And that person's going to be dead next. Alright, you go heal up the dirge because he's not doing well. And you, darling, you might actually need to drink a potion. Either that or... Oh, that'll be 
Cool, just start. These people are all showing up. I see, I see. Can we reach over there? We can. Wonderful. Just wonderful. Uh, okay, now. You. Can we throw something else? We can't. Okay, that's fair enough. Can you drink a potion? Yes, drink a healing potion. And then probably fall back slightly. Now, that isn't going to do near as much good as... Hmm. Can we hit this lot with a fireball? We can't. No, we, we can't. Or maybe we can. That was pretty good. And it didn't break my concentration. Well, that's useful. Twitch betrayed you again. Oh, that's terrible, Hafiaka. Well, I'm glad you at least got here. You know, you didn't miss... Oh, dear. What the point was that... What was the point of that? Not very good. Yeah, you're dead. I'm, I'm sick of you. I'm so sick of you. But I'm so chuffed you could make it. Terrible shame about the, uh... The lack of a notification, though. They just keep screaming at me. You know, if I can kill the adept... I'm not worried about the other two. Ah, but it had... It had the death ward on it. That could be a bit of a problem. Alright, heal dirge again, actually. Oh, I could have used lay on hands in the first place. That probably would have been better. You see... Can you do anything over here? No? No. But can you throw another bomb? Because that might just kill them all. Perfect. Give it a toss. Oh, well it didn't kill them all, but <laughs> these two are very badly injured, and that one's dead. And um, I would call that a success. Now let's just all of us retreat inside. They all have to go past both the Guardian of Faith and the Cloud of Daggers to get to us. Okay, Shadowheart, maybe you want to head inside, because they keep trying to kill you. They keep shooting at you. Let's just fly over there and smack him. Marvelous work. <laughs> Are we... By, does Mommy refer to Minthara? Uh, she's... She's not very happy with me for killing, uh, killing Isabel. But other than that, she's fine, I think. Okay, now, Shadowheart, you... Are more guards coming? Where did you lot come from? More guards are coming. This is fine. You know what? We need the experience. Uh, Shadowheart, just run inside, please. But also cast another spiritual weapon. We're going to need it. Okay, Minthara. Now, Minthara doesn't have any ranged weapons, so... Can I hit her? You know what, actually, before I even think about that, you just sneak up there and stab this man. Can you give him a little shove, too? No? Okay. You're not very good at shoving. Oh, 
That was an acceptable shove, I would say. Okay, now unfortunately, uh, that's the end of your turn, which is not ideal. Ah, and here's a plan. So put darkness there. Wonderful. Okay, can you just... No. I think it's best, actually, Starion, if you don't do anything. This man's dead. Really? Did the Guardian have so few health? I would have assumed much more. I thought it had 40. Did he do that much damage? Come on, run through the daggers. They can't even shoot at me right now. Hmm. Well, let's get that guardian back up. Uh, okay, that's not ideal. Never mind. Actually, I think the best bet, the best thing we can do right now is just retreat in here and close the door. They're going to kill themselves on these. You just wait. Wait till they run in. <laughs> there we go. So now they all have to go past this in order to get to me. Which is probably not going to end well for them. I mean, it only does you know, 12 or so damage, but they're all, all going to have to collect over there. It's, it's blessing the scrying eyes. Brilliant work, Acolyte Dane. Absolutely magnificent. Come on. Come on, darlings. Come on in. <laughs> oh, look, more are coming. This is, this is going to keep going on until we get rid of those, after, isn't it? Okay. Shadowheart, open this door. Minthara, stop focusing on that. Astarian, you come out here. Take your, your weird little things and put them over here. That'll kill so many of them. And it should help us get the scrying eye down ASAP as well. Now I want you to just misty step back inside. So that you're no longer at risk. Now, Guardian of Faith, put it back over here. And Minthara. Uh, actually, no. Alright, that's good. Minthara, you do nothing. And you... Actually... I want this again. Actually, you know what? That's fine. We'll just close the door. Shadowheart's slightly peeking through the door there. Might want to reconsider that one, Shadowheart. Actually, wait, wait, do I have a bomb I can throw? I do, don't I? Okay, can you just, uh... Okay, Shadowheart, actually. Do you have any... You can't move at all, and you've blocked the door. Brilliant. Just brilliant. Okay. Uh, okay, I have an idea. We will throw a bomb over here, because, I mean, if we can... If we can get a bomb over there, that would be quite catastrophic for them. 
think it took out the eyes at least. Uh, okay, now, now Minthara, I want you to unend your turn. Oh, she doesn't have it anymore. That's not good. <laughs> okay, Shadowheart? No. Okay, I'm just exposed now. That's fine. Minthara, come join me. I'm going to need- Oh no, I'm invisible! That's perfect, actually. Close the door. It's fine. I'm just going to retreat invisibly. You'll never catch me. I'm Invisiman. How are you going to hamstring him? He doesn't have legs. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. He's floating. Oh my god, he's almost dead. He didn't even get to attack anyone. I thought he was supposed to attack back if they did a melee attack. I'm confused as to what his utility actually is now. I think I'm going to get rid of him at this point. I love it when they just run in there. Oh. Well, you didn't even have to run into the, the, the cloud. Well, at least they're, they're focusing hard on attacking someone who's not me. Hmm. Okay, what do we do now? The Starion can't actually move that now, which is a bit of an issue. But I might be able to do something uh, with scroll. What scrolls do I have here? I have Ghast. Do I have any Cloud of Daggers? That would be marvellous. Let's look at my scrolls. There we do. I do have a cloud of dagger. Okay, let's do it. That's marvelous. Hello, I'm back. It's me. Daddy bye. Okay, Shadowheart, just uh give them the guiding bolt. Whichever one's beefiest right now. Uh that one. Okay, that was useless. You're useless. <laughs> uh, you fall back completely. And then I think Minthara just closed the door. And next turn they're going to get absolutely decimated. Except for perhaps Nerum and Benel. And of course those lot. Starion, stay put. Oh, he critted. This, this Guardian of Faith has done absolutely nothing except for tank some of the attacks. He jumped from one cloud of daggers to another. <laughs> Marvellous. Genuinely, I don't know what the, the Guardian's supposed to do. My entire understanding of him was that he was supposed to uh, reflect back uh, damage from a melee attack. supposed to take the attack, take some damage, and then deal it back. Doesn't seem to be working that way. Okay, I have no idea what's going on out here, but people are definitely dying. Okay, now they've all gathered, now they've all gathered around. Uh, excellent. Minthara, let's open up and see where they are. Perfect. Okay, these two are, are definitely still going to go through those clouds of daggers. Now, hmm. What's the best way to deal with this lot? Probably, uh, with violence. Oh, well. Nice try, I suppose. Let's go. Just go over here and hit them with the thunder wave. 
one is dead. That's that's satisfactory. Uh, I don't want to break my concentration because that's going to be useful still, but there we go. Now fall back. Now it is uh, Astarian's turn, I believe. But let's end your turn, too. You, you've done enough. What should you do? You should just wait for a moment, Shadowheart. You haven't been very useful in this fight, at least. This person here is going to about is about to get sprayed with poison, right in the face. Lovely. <laughs> okay, now let's close the door. Uh, and Shadowheart, I think just wait. Let's watch him run through that. We'll get up to the door, and then we can all just take him on. He had to dash to get here, so he's buggered. Absolutely buggered. Lovely. Give him another smack, darling. It was beautiful the first time. Oh, you failed that time. I'm disappointed. Okay, Mentaro. I'm going to give you one last chance here. To kill this man. You did it. Beautiful work. We've done it! We killed just so many guards! <laughs> oh my god, how many acolytes are left in the whole damn building after that? Uh, okay, we'll take a little rest. Time to get going. I get the feeling that all the guards by the door have, uh... But this is what you get, Warden, for sassing me. I kill you and every single person on your side. Okay, well, let's take her goods. No, let's go upstairs for a moment. Oh no, we can check this chest. What's in here? Oh, Shadowheart, why are you why are you the main character? You shouldn't be the main character. You may be God's favourite princess, but you're not mine. Hello, I My god, how did you miss that? There we go. Problem solved. Now, open these chests. Okay, lockpick. Take all the goodies. I love goodies. Wonderful. Nothing in there. A trap disarmed kit. That could be useful. And Walbrin's hammer. Let's take this to him. I don't know why I'm helping him. I mean, I'm helping him mostly because I know that he's going to help me. He's going to help furnish me with uh, explosives later down the line. So. Oh, look. Let's just raid all their bodies, sure. Well, Mr. Bongle. Uh, we seem to have killed all the guards. Shouldn't you be assisting the absolute? Perhaps by torturing a sweet grandma. Have we not had this conversation already, darling? I do tend to do those things. But here, uh, I'm literally There you go, Walton. Yes. I'm here to help you. Good work. It's time, go. Honestly, darling, there's there's no risk of anyone else coming. I've killed everyone. So, in fact, I'm probably going to have to open up that, uh, that passageway myself. Right, let's just clear, pull this communal cell lever. Okay, well... We did quite well. I mean, look at all the people we killed. I'm I'm quite proud of us. Hello, little gnomes. How are you doing? Okay, first and foremost, there should be goodies over here. I need to dig them up. Marvellous. I'll take all those goodies. Now, bongle.
Unless you have a better idea. Well, there was this inn. Uh... <laughs> but it's unfortunate not there. Uh, yeah, just stay on the water. Now that is a plan I can get behind. From me and every Iron Hand gnome in the realm, thank you. You've done more than you could ever know. Slightly ominous. But he did actually thank me there, so that's fine. Tatty, bye. We don't need to watch them that long. Like, okay, they're off. That's fine. Let's keep going. We've got other things to do. We have rescued Walbrin Bongo. Honestly, I was I was half-hearted about rescuing him, and then the warden pissed me off. <laughs> uh, okay, that's disgusting. More meat. Uh, wait. Shadowheart. What are you doing? <laughs> so frustrating. I'm glad I noticed before it was too late. Okay. Well, I see. I see a descent here. So we are going to take that descent. Into the fleshy lands. Oh, that doesn't sound pleasant, does it? Something skittering. Oh, yes, very, very fleshy. We are in the oubliette. Uh, there are hook horrors here. Oh yes, this is not a nice place to be. Let's be on my way. Feels like home. Actually, it occurs to me. Uh, we, we have we have no... <laughs> I was about to start this fight. We have no uh, spell slots on a Starian. <laughs> so we might need to take a long rest first. But that's fine. You know what? It's been a while. Let's take a long rest. Hello, owl bear. Wait, oh yes, I can still talk to animals. Hello, my friend. You smell very delicious, but I will not bite you. Thank you, it's the blood. I'm going to give him a little pit. I need to be slottier to fight the hook horrors. Honestly, they're not that high level, but... Minthara, why are you crouched like that? <laughs> She's still in sneak mode. Minthara, what are you doing? You weirdo. You wish to consult me? Let's hear you badmouth another of our the companions. How have you been lazy and lazy at I have encountered few Githyanki in my life. Those that I did were raiders. They croaked out pleas for mercy in their alien tongue as they died. Meeting you as I makes me wish I knew more of their culture. It's not too dissimilar from ours. Whatever culture you and I once shared, it no longer has a hold on me. You still listen to the whispers of the Spider Queen's web. I only obey my own heart's desires. Sure. Most well, Gith do not seem to know their own hearts. Nor do they need to. They have strict hierarchies and commitment to a single cause. Some, like Lazelle, question that cause. But even so, she retains the discipline of her training. Uh, what nasty thing do you have to say about Shadowheart? It would have been better for us had she embraced Shah and claimed the power of the goddess. I have no idea what you're talking about. But it is better for Shadowheart to be free of that. <laughs> Her dialogue is so busted. <laughs> Very, uh, what do you have against Shah? The Singer has some admirable qualities. 
far more than her insipid sister. But her followers are repressed. Take the child, Shadow Heart. She does not even know who she is, but still manages to pity herself. The very concept of shaman worship is self-indulgent. Oh, absolutely. They would have you think every whispered word and hidden thought is of value. But it is not so. I have performed a thousand interrogations, squeezing out the most guarded secrets held in heart, mind, and soul. I can tell you this. When the trivial parts have been whittled away and I have sifted through what remains, in most cases, Person amounts to nothing at all. What does that have to do with Sharon worship? That just seems like an. <laughs> Her dialogue is so balked. Okay, speaking of balked, hello, Scratch. Hope you're keeping well, friend. No, I'm terrible. Look at me. I'm covered in blood. It's okay. Let's let's have a little pit with Scratch. Good boy. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> I'm not sorry. I would. I'm sorry. I wasn't the one to do it myself. Oh, we have to go to the traveler's chest. I. I keep. I keep forgetting. We need to require. There is a particular. Oh no! I sold them, didn't I? I sold them. No. Okay, but I think I might know who I sold them to. So that's Speak fine. Quickly. We'll figure that out later. Heavy crossbow. Spell slot restoration. We'll give that to a starion. Because he doesn't like wearing his collar that I gave him. Uh, that. Eh, that doesn't seem too hard. Cacophony. No, no, we need him to keep, we need him to keep carrying the, uh, the moon lantern. Okay, then everyone as you were, let's just go to sleep. Let's just have a nap. Oh, is there another cutscene here? Oh dear. Oh no. Oh, hello. You're both all right. Are you both all right? Do I still speak with animals? Or? What's going on? I thought something was the matter. Just a bad dream. It's all right. Goblin had me in a cage. Oh. Poor owl bear has PTSD. We're safe here with Master. Oh. Okay. Give it a little time. Yeah, of course I'm Master. You two look cozy. Bad dreams aside. Still young. I remember Gonwick would let me sleep under his cloak when I was a pup. Yeah, as long as no one's getting hurt, I'm the only one allowed to hurt people. Easy now. The guardian's just looking out for us. Alright, did you call me master? I, I, I suppose I did. You've been good to us. To both of us. Gonwick would be happy I'm with you, I think. It's marvellous. Like it, Everyone will call me master before fire. we're done. Scratch reminds me of Big Brother. Big Brother? Do you have a brother? Used to. Mother ate him. Oh my god. <laughs> Our bears are the worst. <laughs> mother ate him and you ate mother. Well, okay, it's the circle of life, I guess. Uh, well, you're both welcome here, darlings. Good boys. Good boys. Look at that. And that's how you get the you have two hands for a reason ach uh, achievement. <laughs> Mantara and I are just... Actually, everyone's meditating except for Shadowheart. Shadowheart has to sleep eight hours a day. The rest of us just meditate for four hours and then have an orgy. 